Good morning. I hope that you guys are having an amazing day. I am having a cup of coffee before I hit these streets because there are some things I need to pick up from the store. So I got to fuel up before I go. So I'm just adding a little bit of pumpkin spice to my coffee and I got that pumpkin spice from Walmart for like a dollar. Can you believe that? Alright, um, so any of you guys ever make a pot of coffee and some days it's like the best experience in the world and then other times it's like, um, did I make colored or flavored water? Well, this was one of those flavored water kind of days where I just made it work and sip my coffee and I'm off. So I'm on my way to go pick up my mom, my chica, my ride or die. I will be taking her with me and we are going to go and do a little bit of shopping. If you have any questions about this unit that I'm wearing, you can hit me up in the description box and I will give you the deets on that. So the first place we stopped at was Bath and Body Works. They were playing music, so I had to do a voiceover on this as well. I love the way they redecorated. It's so pretty in here. It kind of reminds me of like how they have um, Victoria's Secret set up now or something. It's just so pretty. So I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of this video and I will see you soon. Hey guys so I am back from the store and I'm just going to show you guys some of the things I picked up really quickly and then I have a package that I got from I think this was from eBay I think I, I think that's what that is um so let's just jump right into this so we can get this over with So I went to Bath and Body Works because I know that they had 50% off of some of their fall, uh, what do you call those things that you plug into the wall? I can never think of the name of these. I always call them plugins, but I know they're not plugins. They are not votives. Do, 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 do. Well, whatever. But y'all know what I'm talking about. So I picked up, how many did I get? Five or six? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I got five of them. And I have mahogany apple. Mm. 
Welcome home. Caramel pumpkin swirl. Apple weather. And then I have a vanilla birch. Okay, so I picked those up and I have the only one I know what smells like is the caramel pumpkin swirl. That's the only one that I know what smells like, but they were regularly $6.50 and then you got them 50% um, off, which made them like $3.25 a piece. And then I had a 25% off coupon. So I ended up spending around $13 for these. All right. So then I went back to my favorite store. That store is really becoming a favorite of mine. So I went back to Gabe's. No, not Gabe's. Oh, I went back to Valley Discount. And I picked up some more earrings. Because I told you most of the earrings are a dollar. So I got these right here. Open them up so I can show them to you guys. Okay. So I got these right here. They just have the little pearl beading on them. I thought those were so cute and they were only a dollar. And then I picked up this right here and i want to say it's a bracelet um let's see all right and i think it's supposed to be one of them bracelets that you can squeeze it to make it fit your arm mm, nope is it a necklace? <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. Um, it could be a bracelet because it does have, I don't know if you can see them rhinestones right there. But I'm thinking this is supposed to be a bracelet. It was only $1.99 so I didn't spend too much on it but I can definitely put something on either side like this to make it look more like a bracelet yeah I saw something different completely in my head when I picked this up and that is not what's going on, y'all. So, oh well. So, yeah. Um, then we'll go with that. Okay, so we still in Valley Discount. I picked up this LED lamp because I am into doing my own nails now. So, um, I did an acrylic dip. Now, mind you, I've painted these over several times, and this is my first time doing it. But this is the acrylic dip that I did. And I really like the way it came out. And I like doing it this way because it allows me to make my nails as long or as short as I want them to be. And I don't have to spend... I'm not saying getting your nails done was a lot of money. But if I can do it at home myself and change it out whenever I want and all that good stuff, then I'm going to do it. But... Mm, excuse me. I picked this up and I'm excited to see what this is like. What's in here? I didn't open it up at the store. I should have. But I didn't. So let's hope that it has everything it's need it that's needed. Oh, okay. All right, 
right, so it does come with the light. And it stands up like this and you set your nails under here like this and then it has a timer on it 30 seconds or 60 seconds and this is the plug that comes with it so that's neat so I will be doing my nails again soon and I think I'm gonna do a video for it to show you guys you know just a step-by-step -step on doing your own nails at home it's something new for me to try so i'm gonna go ahead and try it out right i know that this first time was a fail but i'm thinking as i time progress i'll get better and better so all right what did i get next so next i went to tj maxx and i went in there looking for something else and i don't even remember what it was but i know i didn't come out with it um but I did pick this up because I needed something to soak off this acrylic that I have on my nails right now. So this is a professional nail soak and it soaks off um, gel and all nail coatings. So this should get this acrylic off my nails so I can do a new set tomorrow. And now that I know a little bit better about what I'm doing through trial and error, I can give it another try. And this was only $2.99, y'all. And then, oh, I forgot something. While I was at Valley Discount, I did pick up these nail tools right here. He had them for four in a pack for $1.99. But the ones he had in the pack looked like they were all the same size. So he sold these to me because they were out of the pack. He sold them to me for $0.25 cents each. And these are the nail dotting tools for doing your nails. So... This right here ought to be fun. And then, while I was at TJ Maxx, I picked up this palette right here. And I'm going to try to get it open for you guys. Mm, they don't want you to get in here, do they? Okay, so I finally broke into my uh, eyeshadow palette, and this is a 12 shadow palette with a dual ending brush, and this is by Cargo, and it's called Namaste in India. And these are some of the colors on the back, and this was $7.99. I thought the colors were so cute, especially for the fall season, so I was like, $7.99 cargo. Yeah, you coming with me. So when you open it, it opens just like this. And then you have your little plastic right here to cover the mirror so the mirror don't get dirty. And let me take this off real quick. And then it has another plastic on top of it, but these are the colors. And they are so freaking pretty. They are in like um, these rich greens and uh, neutral colors and tans and golds and browns. And I like this palette because I have brown eyes and green. Sorry, y'all. Green is supposed to bring out the color of your brown eyes. So let me go ahead and just watch it for you guys real quick and just show you I'm gonna show you three colors oh that gold is pretty all right so this is uh -oh. this one is Darjeeling I don't know if these are names of countries or what but I do this wrong every time damn it Okay, there we go. Can y'all see that? And then this one is Diwali. And 
then this one is Bollywood. I think these colors are so, so pretty. I cannot wait to get my brush into that palette. All right, so let me see what else I got. I have these lights. And I got these lights from, what's that hardware store? It's the store that men go into. Well, men go into all hardware stores, I guess. Harbor Freight. Oh my God, Harbor Freight. And I picked up these lights because my husband bought me some lights to go here in the shed to give me more light. And he picked these up. And I absolutely love the way they look. And you can take them and adjust these right here so that they can turn either way. And it's battery operated. So this is going to go in my bedroom right above my mirror and in my closet because I am going to be creating me a little vanity space in my closet so you guys have to stay tuned for that video and see the results of that but um this comes with four swivel headlights and you can either hang it up so that it clips on or you can use the um sticky tape that they have on the back so let me sh okay so those lights are super cute aren't they all right guys so now let's get on to my package Sorry, just trying to make sure anybody creeping up on a sister. Ugh. I knew I should have bought some scissors or something out here with me. Y'all need some intermission music while I open up this package. Okay. All right, I got it open, so let's see what I ordered. I know it's something for my nails, but I can't remember what. Ooh. Now why is it all individually wrapped? Oh, have mercy. I'm going to be here all day. Alright guys, so I am going to open all of these up and I will let you see what I got because if not, we will be here all day because these packages, you know they secure as a mug. So let me open them up and then I'll come back and show you. Okay guys, so I finally got everything open. Oh, rule number one, my first order of business is to bring me some scissors out here with me. Alright guys, so this is the Nicole Diary Nail Dip Kit. And you get, that's one, two, three, four. Where's one? <sighs> so anyway, you get the base coat, which you're supposed to put on your nails. And then you get the activator. And then you get the top coat. So, um, this didn't come with any instructions, so I guess I'm going to have to go on YouTube to figure out what um, I'm supposed to do. I kind of got the gist of it because I did these already with another kit by Kiss, but um, these had different gel color powders so, or dipping powders, so that's why I wanted these. So, this is like a white. It don't even have the names of the powder on it, but... That's what that one looks like. Then they have almost like a gray tone one. And then like a almost iridescent kind of pink. And then this one is like a pearl white. And it got the numbers on it, but I forgot what the numbers stand for. But the numbers aren't on all the bottles. And then I got this pretty pinkish, reddish color right here. And then I guess they just decided to throw in a free gift. So I got this Born Pretty Nail Art. 
It's supposed to be a nail decoration. In the words of Shula King, anybody want to tell me what is what what is this? What is this? This ain't art. It's definitely not for my nails. What am I gonna do with this? Where's this going? Is it like one earring? What? I don't I don't get it. Why did they even put this in here? I would have took this out and gave me the instructions. <laughs> that probably would have been better. But that's what you get when you get stuff on Amazon or eBay. Everything ain't always looking like the picture. So note to self, just keep that in mind. You're not going to get everything that looks like the picture. But with that being said, that is all I got for you guys today. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. And I think the next video, you're going to see me try to do these nails again. Now, I ain't do too bad. Other than the polish job, I think the acrylic is a little too thick. I know the trick to this is filing, filing, filing. You have to file down this acrylic or you're going to have the biggest, bulkiest nails ever. And that's not what we want. And they also have a uh, poly gel system where, excuse me guys, they have a poly gel system where it's like a... Um, a gel that you put into a nail form and then you put the nail form on your nail and then you can just then you can just peel the uh gel the nail form off and it will look like you have gel nails on so i got that on the way so i'm gonna try that but in the meantime i am gonna go ahead and give these a try one more time and whichever one i like best that is the one that i'm gonna go with i got a feeling i'm gonna like the poly gel a lot better it might be a little bit easier and not as much filing, but we'll see. All right, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and let you go. I will talk to you in the next video. See you then.